You guys, my boy Retro 707 Grill came through once again. Tell me those aren't busting, baby. <laughs> Man, I really needed a re-up, especially with my Pure Money 4s being as beat as they are. These go, I mean, you see the pants, you see the vibes. Reverence coming soon. You know what I'm saying? I told you I'm coming with the nylon pants real soon here. Yes. What's going on Sneak Geeks? Welcome back to another video, man. Today, we have the Air Jordan 4 White Oreo. Now, I got a lot of questions about this shoe. So, I mean, here it is, man. We're not gonna do any B-roll or anything crazy. You know what I'm saying? We can get right to it. Bro, someone actually told me, hey, Mike, I've been rocking with your videos for the longest time, but this video was OD too long. If I wanted to watch a vlog, I would. Wait a minute. Wait, wait a minute. <laughs> Shut your ass up, bro. What you talking about, man? I'll make videos as long as I want. Now, those of you that might be new to the sneaker game, or maybe you just don't know, this actually basically like reminisces the original Oreo 4. And I remember like coming up young, like a younger sneakerhead. I wanted the Oreo 4s so bad. Ended up getting them. I don't ever wear them. I know I still got them somewhere around here. Uh, but they did go with an all white leather, and then you have your really dope honestly just the color blocking of the sneaker is phenomenal especially being like a summer shoe these are set to release july 3rd retail is going to be 190 dollars and you guys can find all the links down below at a sneakerlife.com i'll be sure to put up a blog so first vlog first blog man so go check out the site let me know what you think it's not done yet but you know still a work in progress now this shoe really gives me those pure money vibes you guys know i love my white sneakers and just the simplicity of it, you know, they didn't make this too complicated. A lot of times Jordan Brand releases these alternate trash shoes, but this one is very solid. You know, like I said, beautiful white leather. Awesome. Just stunning, right? You see that? You see that cement print? Ooh, butter. And just the cherry on top, they hit you with that beautiful red jump man. And oh boy has been exercising, as you guys can tell. Ain't too big of a fella. He looked like he got a little belly, but nothing too crazy. And yeah, man, it's just a very nice shoe. Even in that bottom sole, just coca white. You know what I'm saying? That coca. That cement color jump man on the back. Now, I want to just show you guys my Pure Money 4s in comparison. Just in case you were wondering how all white sneakers typically hold up. Now, you can tell I've worn these a lot. I could definitely clean them. I've been cleaning these shoes one time, but I've worn them a lot and they still look really solid, actually. Now, you're going to get that yellowing typically regardless. I'm pretty sure after a few years, these are gonna yellow. It's just something that happens, it's the oxidation process. Really the only way you could potentially avoid yellowing is to put it in like some 3M bags, which I can make an updated video about that if you guys really care. But I mean, shoes are meant to be worn. So if you're gonna get these, honestly, just wear them, keep them clean. You guys can even see the sole. Um, I mean, worn a lot, but not too much heel drag or anything crazy there. So I would expect these, are gonna look like these eventually. One thing that I don't think they did is, you know, maybe they did use somewhat, eh, it's pretty close. Um, the material and the leather quality is still phenomenal, so I ain't mad at that. Um, one thing I love about these actually is the tongue is pretty um, cushiony versus, you know, I think it's really funny how Jordan Brand always does the tongues different. Like if you notice different models, tongues are always different. As you can see, this one isn't as padded versus you know this has a little more padding and i actually love when they do a lot of padding with the jordan threes now honestly i mean 
I don't think there's anything else to say. I mean, we can take a quick look at the box if you guys want to see it. You know, they did do a nice little change up from your typical box. So I do love that concept. Um, other than that, man, it's just a simple all white Jordan 4. I mean, there's not really much else to say. I'll put these on feet and you guys can really decide if this is a cop or a drop for you. Let me know down below in the comments. Will you be going for or picking up the white Oreo 4s? This is your boy, Sneaker Life. You guys can do me a huge favor and hit that thumbs up button. It helps the channel so much, but I'll catch you guys in the next one. Run it.